The mighty Amazon River and its surrounding rainforest is home to millions of different species of animals, with new ones being discovered regularly. Here are the ones you won't find anywhere else in the world. Pale-headed Saki Monkey Once you see a picture of a pale-headed Saki Monkey, you'll never forget this distinctive-looking primate. The males have a short-haired white face and a long-haired black body, while females are grayer and have a stripe on their faces. They live in the trees of the Amazonian rainforest. These monkeys are strong jumpers and have been seen leaping over 30 feet to escape a predator. Living nearby are various monkey cousins, including the brown-backed bearded Saki monkey, which is found in Brazil's Amazonian Rio Negro region. Bald Wakari Unique Amazon mammals also live in the rainforest trees throughout the river basin. The bald Wakari is one of them. Their bright red faces look a little devil-like when they bare their teeth, and those jaws are powerful enough to crack open a Brazil nut. These short-tailed primates eat only fruits and veggies, but are threatened by humans who sometimes hunt them for food. A bigger risk for the primate is deforestation. Giant otter. This endangered otter is found only in remote parts of the Amazon, where it's estimated only 2,000 to 5,000 remain. Habitat loss continues to threaten them, though most were wiped out by hunters wanting their luxurious fur. Jeremy Goodman, PhD, the executive director of Roger Williams Park Zoo, describes the mammals as one of the most endearing species, and very loud. You can see and hear the mammals at his Providence, Rhode Island Zoo. Blue-throated macaw. This large blue-green and yellow bird was thought to have become extinct in the 1980s due to deforestation and poaching for the pet trade. But about 50 of the birds were found in Bolivia in 1992, according to the American Bird Conservancy. Blue-throated macaws like to nest in large trees, of which there are few remaining. So the American Bird Conservancy and its Bolivian counterpart have been working to designate land to protect them and encourage them to use nest boxes. The macaws are adapting, and it's estimated that the population is now around 450. Giant armadillo. It is a species of cingulate mammal in the family Dacepodidae. It is the current largest armadillo. It is found widely in tropical rainforests in eastern South America and ranges in very habitats as far away as northeastern Argentina. The giant armadillo is considered an endangered species. The only predator is the man who hunts it immoderately to use its armor as decoration and its meat as exotic food. South American Tapper The tapper, or Mbarevi, is a perissodactyle widely distributed in jungles, spines, and wetlands of South America. They are excellent swimmers and divers, and they also move very fast on land. They have a longevity of 25 to 30 years. During the day, they tend to move into forests, and at night, they go out to more open areas such as scrublands or grasslands, rivers, and lagoons. Poison Dart Frogs This frog is extremely poisonous, enough to kill a human in seconds. Its colors warn you perfectly in the jungle. Historically, the indigenous people have used it as a biological weapon, rubbing the tips of their arrows on the back of poison dart frogs, hence its name. Giant Anteater The giant anteater is one of the most striking and peculiar mammals of Argentina. It has an elongated snout devoid of teeth, from which a long tongue protrudes that it uses to obtain its main food, ants and termites. Thanks to their long tail, these animals can measure up to 2 meters in length. This species is found in the Chaco region of northern Argentina and in the humid forests of the province of Misiones. Green Iguana it is a genus of lizards of the Iguanina family native to tropical areas of Central America, South America, and the Caribbean. The common species is 1.50 meters long. On the neck and back, it has a high crest, formed by independent spines. Another similar series of spines appears under the chin. It has a long and narrow body and tail. With the latter, it can deliver powerful blows, although it's a harmless animal. They are herbivorous animals and reproduce through eggs that are placed underground during the month of February. Golden Lion Tamarin, also known as the Little Lion Titi, Leontopithecus rosalia, platyrine primate species of the Calitrachina, subfamily native to eastern Brazil, where there are about a thousand individuals in the wild and forests on the Atlantic coast to the southwest of Rio de Janeiro. From head to body, it achieves a length of 20 to 37 centimeters. The tail measures 30 to 40 centimeters. The weight is 360 and 800 grams. Glass frog. 
Glass frog common name of the amphibians belonging to the Centralenida family, named for their translucent abdominal skin. Native to the cloud forests of Central and South America, 13 species have been identified in Costa Rica. These nocturnal tree-dwelling frogs remain camouflaged during the day on the underside of leaves. They are small. They measure between 20 and 23 millimeters. They live on the branches and leaves of certain trees. They feed on small insects. Carachama. Another fish unique to the Amazon is the carachama, a type of catfish. The fish's black and gray scales form a kind of armor protecting it from the other fish found in the Amazon's rivers. It used to be a popular fish for soup and for grilling, but it is now illegal to fish for it in many areas. Today, pollution is the biggest risk to carachama. Arapaima gigas. Also swimming through the Amazon and its tributaries, lakes, and swamps is the arapaima fish. In Brazil, it's called a piruruku, and the name in Peru is peche. This mega fish is one of the world's largest freshwater fish, reaching lengths of 10 feet and weighing 40 pounds. The world's largest fish is the whale shark, one of the facts that you probably didn't know about whale sharks. These are air-breathing fish that breathe with a coughing noise. Because of this, they stay close to the water's surface, which makes them all too easy to catch with a harpoon. The arapaima's main threat is overfishing. Black Cayman a less friendly water dweller is the black caiman. This immense alligator can grow 15 feet long, making it the Amazon basin's largest predator. They kill their prey, which includes deer and tapirs, in a grisly way first drowning it, and then swallowing it whole. As hatchlings, the caiman is preyed on by birds, rodents, and other animals. The main threat to the black caiman adults is humans. We kill them for their meat and hide, cut down the trees supporting their food, and burn their swamplands. Green anaconda. Living sometimes in the water and sometimes out is the green anaconda. It's the largest snake in the world weight-wise. The reticulated python can grow longer, but weighs only half as much. Reports National Geographic. The green anaconda is 20 to 30 feet long and weighs over 500 pounds. A member of the boa constrictor family, anacondas squeeze their prey and then swallow it whole. Even something as large as a jaguar. Amazon river dolphin. Of the animals that live within the Amazon River itself, this pink freshwater dolphin is a crowd favorite, also called a bato or a pink river dolphin. Tens of thousands of the long-nosed creatures remain, but because of threats caused by dams and by water and food contamination from mining, the dolphin is classified as vulnerable by the World Wildlife Fund. Some fishers even injure or kill them, believing they're a threat to diminishing fish stocks. Steps are underway to help. For example, in 2018, Peru created a new national park, Yaguas, near the Colombian border to help protect the pink dolphins and the Amazon's other unique wildlife. Stay safe, stay